What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Forever Brandon TV coming back to you guys with another video on Chloe and Halle Bailey. Guys, the you all know that they are on Beyonce's record label Parkwood Entertainment, guys, which y'all I am so excited and I'm I'll probably discuss in another video. But <laughs> anyway, we finna get we finna get into um, Chloe and Halle. Now, this is their first album, guys. They have been discovered. Beyonce discovered them. They did a cover to Pretty Hurts uh, on YouTube when the self-titled album of Beyonce's album came out. And when she discovered them, she immediately called them and found out who they were and asked to uh, and signed them to her record label. So now, ever since then, Chloe and Halle have been slaying. Like, these girls are really amazing. When I'm telling you, their voices, the way they blend their voices together, just really, really, like, they just really stand out as uh, musicians. And I really like them. Like, they really did. They, they really are. They did projects like Sugar Symphony, The Two of Us. They even did something called Uncovered. I think that was like a project or something that didn't really get released. Uh, I didn't know about that one, but um, I do know about Sugar Symphony, guys. I didn't get a chance to review that one because I was real busy in 2016. I was, when I was busy with school or whatever, but guys, I am really excited to um, announce that I will, I am reviewing their first studio album, The Kids Are All Right. Now, guys, this album is Contemporary R&B. It's, uh, with the label Parkwood Columbia. Y'all know that's Beyonce's record label. Um, and they did the doggone thing. Like, I really like these girls. Like, they, the, their voices, like, they just really, really sound so good together. Um, the way they sing, their music is really different. They have a, a R&B slash al alternative sound to their music that's really, really good. So, on this album, they have 18 tracks. Um, uh, and the songs are not that long, but the songs are really, really good. Hello, Friend was just a beautiful intro. They was just really singing. You know, they really, really was really singing really good on it. Um, and uh, they really have good messages in their songs that I think that's very, very, um, that the, the, the kids of this generation, like, really need to listen to it. Like, they're kind of, you know, setting set an example for the kids of the new generation. And they're kind of trying to set an example, you know, about believing in yourself. And anyway, back on topic. Okay. The kids are all right. The first song, amazing. What I'm telling you is really good. Also, you guys know that um, Chloe and Halle are on uh, Grownish, which is going really, really good. Like, I really, really like the show, guys. Um, they, they play an important part on that show, and they actually have great acting skills as well. Um, they, they, this song kind of premiered on that show, I think, a little bit. And uh, I really like it. It's just basically talks about how the kids express themselves these days. And I like it. I really do. The next song is Grown. It's basically saying, like, they're telling their mothers, like, they, we, we're not little kids anymore. We're getting grown now. They're getting, they're getting, they're getting more uh, growner. You know, they're getting grownish. And this is actually the, the, uh, the song, the first, the actual song that's on Grownish, like, the actual when the show comes on, the intro of the show, and it's really, really good. Uh, High Low featuring Gold Link. Now, I'm not the biggest Gold Link fan, but I really do like the song. It just basically talks about the highs and the lows of life. Like, you know, what people go through. I like it. The next song, Five, Everywhere. Amazing, amazing. When I'm telling you, this is probably like one of my favorites on the album. They just really, really did an amazing job with the song. It's just basically talking about how they got money everywhere. I live for it. I like the message. I like the beat. Like, they kind of added a little trap vibe to it, which was really good. Fa La La um, and a little, was, it was cute. I liked it. Fake featuring Carrie Fox. Guys, it's just basically talking about why you all in my face acting fake and phony. You know, they really, 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 really are claiming they place already with this first album. And it is really, really good. Okay, I like I like it. Baptize is basically an interlude. I like it. It's really good. It was it had a nice they had some nice they just have some really nice melodies. I live. Down is basically uh how you know they're feeling they were feeling down about a situation and you know they're speaking their uh, their their voice and their opinions and I like it. 
Number 10, galaxy. Amazing. It just talks about how the galaxy is in shambles and how they and how, you know, if people try to come for them, they're gonna basically put them out of their misery, basically, is what they're saying. I love it. I live for it. Um, happy without me featuring Joey Badass. Good song. I really liked it. And Joey Badass added an amazing rendition to the song that was really, really good. It's really, really dope. Um uh, Baby Bird. Oh my God, this song is so amazing. When I'm telling you, I like it. It's kind of got a dark edge to it that's really good. Sounds really amazing. Uh, Warrior uh, from A Wrinkle in Time. It's just from the movie A Wrinkle in Time, guys. Uh, good, uh, A really good song. I like it. Cool People is basically talking about there's still cool people on the earth. Um, and, you know, just you just got to know the, the people that you need to hang out with is basically what they're saying on the, uh, on the song. Um, Baby on a Plane is basically a song about a baby crying out for the world. I live for it. I really like the message of the song. It's really good. If God Spoke me is basically a song like if God was, you know, uh, uh, telling us to do something, we better do it, basically. I like it. I live for it. Good song. Uh, 17 Drop. The bonus tracks is Drop and Fall. The songs were amazing. Okay, and I like it. I really like it. And y'all, you guys got to get in tune with Chloe and Holly because they are really like that whole persona, like the the voices. You know, Beyonce knows talent. Okay, when she discovered them, she knew what she was doing, and I really like it. I, you guys got to check it out. Amazing, amazing album. The kids are all right. They're here to let you know. <laughs> Forever Brandon TV. Subscribe.